What's going on, friends? It's Friday. It's Friday. It's a beautiful sunny day out here. I'm ready. I hope you are too. So let's get the day started. If you guys are new to my channel, my name is Mel. Hello, I am a delivery driver. I love multi-apping. So I multi-app around California with DoorDash, Walmart, Spark, and Instacart. So if that's something that you're interested in, stick around. I'm going to be taking you guys along with me. I'll throw you in the back seat. We'll walk around in the store. I'll show you all the things. I'll give you the best advice I can give you, tips. I'm never going to steer you wrong. You're never going to hear me talk negatively. That's one thing. A lot of negativity out there in the gig world, you guys. Like, so... I myself did not feel inspired and motivated by anybody to just keep going. That was one of the things that I was like, oh man, everybody's just like, Meh. and it's very discouraging. So I hope I can be that light and that encouragement and that motivation for you guys out there that are really struggling to find a way to just keep going because I'm right there with you. Dive right into this video. We're going to talk numbers. So yesterday I had an incredible day. I made $249. I'm so excited about that and so humble and grateful for that. So we ended our day at $1,431.84. You guys that are new here, I set a goal for myself to make $155 every single day. So we are starting this goal countdown of the day at $1,586.84. So let's jump into it. It's a windy day out today. I don't know what to say about this order right here. This is the biggest order I've ever had. Ever. What time is it? 12.34. It is three customers. One customer has 24 items. The other one has 19. The other one has five. Miles are big, but look at the payout, you guys. I'm excited. This is like a whole day. Let's see how fast it takes me. I'm probably going to have to do a basket and two carts. Um, put it in different bags just to keep it organized. Uh, but I will show you guys every step of the way. So let's go inside, get this order started. I swear. <laughs> God, what are you doing to me? So good. So good to me. So good to me. Anyway, I'll see you guys inside to tell you. We're going into Stater Brothers. See you inside. I wanted to show you guys how I set up everything. This is going to be customer A. This is going to be customer B. And on the bottom is customer C. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with perishables, you guys. No cold stuff. Do the cold stuff last. This store is set up where it's aisle 20 down. So I'm going to do 20, 19, 18, 17. And I'm going to leave my carts here because I don't want to lug these carts around with people so leave them in a spot shopped four aisles leave them in a spot shop four aisles make it easier for yourself that's how I do it if you guys have better ways of how you do it let me know in the comments hey guys I'm 18 minutes into this order so what I did is I went in all of the aisles that is dry food so this is customer a Customer C still doesn't have anything, and this is customer B. So now that I'm 18 minutes in, I can go around and hurry up and grab all the cold stuff and then check out. So I'll be back when the order is complete with the cold stuff. But that's a tip for you do all the dry stuff first, then last do the cold stuff. You don't want your customer's food to be melted when it gets to the door. You guys, it took me 45 minutes. So customer C is under here. Customer B and customer A. Now I'm going to go to the checkout. You have to do three different orders and bag it three different times. So I'm just going to keep it separate. See you guys at the car. This is the orders all bagged up, you guys. This is one order, which I'm going to put in the back seat right here. This bottom order is two bags. So I'm going to put it in these two black bags and stack them here and then this last full order is going to go in the trunk hope that helps you guys organize when you do three orders see you guys at all three drop-offs and the time is 140. 
Okay, so this order is 24 miles. The one of the customers is 24 miles away, obviously. So um, I have my insulated bags for that customer. So this is the last stop. It all fit in one bag. These two are right down the road. So this was customer C, this was customer A, and this was customer B. It'll tell you who's first. So this is our first stop. This is our second stop. And then 24 miles away, I have it in my cooler bag. That helps you Instacart drivers separate your orders when you have three and keep your items cold for your customer you guys super important you don't want meat or milk or anything sitting out in your car the first customer was five minutes away from stater brothers you guys this next customer is 11 minutes away from that customer the other customer i'll show you guys a picture of the map right here is way down um actually where i was the other day when i was exploring so what I'm gonna do, because I can roam with Instacart, I'll probably find shopping centers down there and hopefully get an order and come back up. Um, there is shopping out there. There is things to do out there and I just have to creep my way back up to my area. It is 24 miles. So um, I will keep you guys posted. Okay, you guys, the second order is dropped off. We are heading to the third customer's house. She is 22 minutes away. We are hopping on the freeway, so hopefully it'll only take about 15, because I will not be mad at that. I drive like a bat on a... All of those orders are dropped off, you guys. I cannot believe this area. It is gorgeous. It was the area I was in the other day. Oh my God. Now I'm sitting outside of Sprouts and I'm, I'm wait for it, wait for it. That's my mentality right now. So we started this day with 1586.84. We take off that Instacart order. That is my biggest stinking order I've ever had. And I've been doing Instacart since 2020, I believe. Don't quote me on that. But the payout was $85.89. So now we are at $1,500 even with 95 cents, okay? Mind blowing to me. Are we gonna we are gonna have another stinking stellar day. I can feel it. Give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. Give, mm, I'm not trying to be selfish, but mm, somebody's looking out for me. I don't know who, but. <laughs> Heading into Sprouts, I am right next to the highway. I grabbed another order. This one is not going where I need to be, but I could not pass this up for the payout. So generous, um, only seven miles, whoopity do. I'm gonna be in and out, another $30. Let's go. I'll see you inside. The order, you guys. See you guys at the drop off. It's dropped off, you guys. Payout was $30.60. 1470.35 we're at and I don't know where I'm at so I have to find a way back to my town you guys I had a DoorDash that was starts at four okay you guys so I stopped to get myself some food so I'm gonna share with you guys don't judge me okay um I stopped at can you see it in the background no I stopped at the habit you guys because totally got fat girl food okay which I deserve it because I've been working hard today Look at this burger. Do you want a bite? Take a big bite. Is it gonna zoom in? Guacamole. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Onion rings, fries, and sweet potato fries. And of course, ranch. Happy dinner to me. So once I finish eating, then we're gonna get our hustle back on. Okay, so we're starting our dinner shift. Um, 
My DoorDash got turned off because I didn't make it up here on time coming from that last order, which is okay. I grabbed myself some dinner, so then the area that I came from, I did a dash along the way because it was red, but the town I'm in is gray. Well, I grabbed this order <laughs> and then it's going back. It's not going too far, but now it's saying that my area is busy. So I'm hoping I can get DoorDash back because I don't feel like doing any more grocery shopping, you guys. I'm beat. Plus I just ate and I'm all fat and full. So, and I want like quick, easy for the rest of the day. So we are heading into Panda Express. Cute little shops along the way here. Look at pandas. I will see you guys at drop off. Okay, that order is dropped off, you guys. The payout was $11.50, so we're at $14.58.85. I have another DoorDash order. I was just here for dinner. <laughs> Go inside, see if it's ready, and I'll see you guys at the drop off. DoorDash order was dropped off, you guys. $8 payout, so we're at $14.50.85. Our next Instacart order, you guys shopping for fruit loops and diapers i'm for it <laughs> gotta go shopping in target so i will see you guys inside the order y'all diapers and fruit loops <laughs> see you guys at the drop off y'all i'm so annoyed this last customer has no respect for anybody's time whatsoever so i checked out she was maybe like five minutes down the road and now it's going on I don't know it's been 35 minutes because in her notes she put call me so when you call her in her notes it goes straight to voicemail she lived in a gated community so you can't just drop the package outside the gate so I sat and waited I called her a bunch of times every time it went to voicemail I waited 10 minutes Wasted my time on the phone with customer service for them to waste my time and call her, not getting a hold of her. And then finally, this guy comes on the phone telling me the wrong gate code. And kept having to call the customer. Because this customer, I don't know, you can't call her on the app. Such a waste of my time. $11.20 is the payout. 1439.65 and it's going on 740. <laughs> people, people, if you order from Instacart, have respect for your driver for the love of God. If you order something you know it's coming, be home and answer your phone. Our next DoorDash order, you guys. Like the payout. Miles aren't bad. I'm gonna hop on the highway, of course. We are heading into Fat Burger. See you guys at the drop off. Fat order is all dropped off. Went nice and smooth. $17 payout. $14.22.65. Next order from DoorDash, you guys. I'll put it up on the screen for you. Going on the other side of town to the same joint. <laughs> Go inside, see if it's ready. I'll see you guys at drop off. Order is dropped off. Eight dollar payout. We're at fourteen fourteen sixty five. Another order. It's from DoorDash, and we're going shopping with our red card for two items. Bonds. So I will see you guys inside. Beef bacon and Cherry Garcia. Order is dropped off, y'all. Nine dollar payout, fourteen oh five sixty five. Next Instacart order. I'll put it up here for you guys. This is all ice cream. <laughs> That's why I took it. <laughs> Back at Stater Brothers. See you guys inside. Here is the order, you guys. Ice cream, coffee, ice cream treats. I want to stop at her house for coffee and ice cream. <laughs> See you guys at drop off. That order is dropped off, you guys. 
payout was $14.79. So we are at $13.90.86. Talk numbers to you guys tonight. I had to stop at the gas station and get some gas. So of course I'm using up to, Upside. We're saving 21 cents a gallon at this gas station. We're at the Chevron. Gas is $4.49. And I filled up with 15.6 ga gallons. I spent $70. So with the Upside app, you guys, I'm saving 21 cents per gallon. That will show up in a few days. I just upload my receipt. If you guys want to check out Upside, make sure you check my comments in the, in the description, you guys. Um, there's a link to sign up for Upside if you want to save money on gas. Okay, you guys, it is going on 10.30, so I need to call it a night. I'm getting so tired. I've been up early this morning. I was up early yesterday hustling, and we got two more days to go. So we started this incredible day with 15.86.84. We had um, my biggest Instacart order yet. We drove a lot of miles this week, and that's okay. Um, we did exploring. I drove a lot of miles today, I know that. And what baffles my brain is like the first half, I forgot to turn on my stride, you guys. So make sure, <laughs> now I'm gonna tell myself, Mel, are you checking your miles? Cause uh, the trip down to the first customer, I forgot to track it, but on the way up and the rest of the day I did. So don't forget to track your miles, you guys. You guys. But I think Instacart tracks my miles because I'm out here in California and they got the Prop 22, so. I'll be okay. We ended the day at 13.90.86. So we had another incredible day. Together we made 195.98. I am so excited. <laughs> $5 away from 200. Um, we did spend $70 on gas, you guys, so take that into consideration. So that's about 100 buckish we made today. But it is what it is. Plus, I'll get my cash back from my gas on Upside and my credit card. So, I'm exhausted, you guys. <laughs> I need a good night's sleep. I hope you guys went out there and crushed your goals today. Let me know what your biggest order was today. My, that was my biggest Instacart order ever. So that was really exciting. I stepped out of my comfort zone today. I was in a new area. I want to try to maybe go up back out there tomorrow. It was really fun out there. Um, lots of miles though. It's, everything's very spacious out there, but it was just gorgeous. Anyway, I'm going to go into Ralph's and I'm going to go find me some treats because I want like a Danish or something for the morning and um, I deserve a treat. I like to go into grocery stores and go in the clearance of their bakery because they mark everything down if it doesn't sell. Love, 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 love. Sweet treat. Anyway, um, let's have some coffee together, my rider dies. Clink, clink. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> I dropped me a, a coffee emoji, you guys. <laughs> and maybe a Heimlich emoji. <laughs> I'm getting like stupid tired. Anyway, we're back at it again. Tomorrow is Saturday. We are gonna hustle. I'm tired. Bye, guys.